two weeks prior to the Olympic Games, Joani Delgaco extends her preparations all the way from Mez France to Schwabsanj, Luxembourg. The idea was encouraged by a member of the Regat Messine who believes it will be a good opportunity for Joani. Uh, it's very interesting for a, a, a high level competition, but to, uh, not to do always the same thing uh, for her, just to prepare the, the race in uh, two and three weeks. And uh, so I think, I hope she, she will win. With a record amount of 38 participating boats this year, the seventh edition of the Weight Roos Head of River will give Joani a chance to take on other rowers from Belgium, Luxembourg, France, and Germany. As you have some, uh, you know, current, the river is not very quiet. There is still current and sometimes wind, so it can be quite, uh, uh, you know, um, demanding. We are very happy, so I hope that she enjoyed. Yeah, uh, we will follow her so on television, eh? so we will uh, be supported. Joani Delgaco was named as the fastest female rower in the 5,000 meters handicap race. Uh, Magkat experience yung nakuha niya dito dahil yung nga, iba-ibang boat category yung nakasa, nakalaban niya. Pati yung mind niya nare-refresh din kasi hindi lang puro siya nag-iisa na nag-detraining sa amit. So ngayon, part ng kanyang training na nakasalamuhan niya iba-ibang teams. Joani herself recognizes how this event would help her in her preparations. Um, isa rin to sa ano, uh, makakatulong sa upcoming uh, game to sa Olympics kasi um, sa ngayon pa lang, um, mara, para sa akin maramdaman ko yung uh, bigat ng training kasi sa actual competition, parang ano po, mas, mas madali na gawin doon. Taglag experience din to sa, para sa akin kasi first time ko rin to mag na basic rowing na 5 kilometers. So yung really risk ko talaga is 2,000 talaga. Para sa akin, uh, makakaragdag siya ng endurance. Aside from getting more experience and strengthening her endurance, Joani also gained the support of her fellow rowers in Europe. First female rower. Okay, so come here. Uh, from Mets France, Denise Stamp.